As we begin the new year, there are concerns that Australia's famous Great Barrier Reef could be placed on the danger list of World Heritage Sites because of climate change. Globally, nearly half of all coral has already died off. Now, in a world first, one startup in Hong Kong is trying to help coral adapt to the problems humans have caused with 3D printing and terracotta. Remy Innocencio took a dive to find out more. Splashing into Hong Kong's subtropical waters, you might be surprised to learn more coral species live here than the Caribbean. Yet this swath of the South China Sea used to boast even more beauty. What was here 100 years ago? We believe that this area was a coral paradise. David Baker is a coral ecologist at the University of Hong Kong. Those who are still with us from the World War II generation, you know, th these people tell you that the water was crystal clear, that there were coral everywhere. But as Hong Kong industrialized, runoff and pollution bled into the waters. So Baker co-founded Arcure Reef, an eco-engineering startup to rebuild this paradise lost. His team, in a world first, 3D printed artificial reef tiles made from terracotta, non-toxic and biodegradable. They placed those on the sandy bottom of a bay and seeded them with living coral. 95% survived in the past two years. How did you even come up with the idea? I just thought to myself one evening that why not tile the, the seafloor like we would tile a kitchen or bathroom floor? These tiles could have global application for coral adaptation with benefits to humanity. Reefs protect homes and businesses, breaking up destructive waves from storms. More than one billion people depend on coral, from fisheries to tourism and medicine. One of the biggest red flags from scientists is that they predict 70 to 90 percent of the coral around the world will disappear in the next 20 years. Trying to make a splash as fast as possible, Arki Reef has now expanded to Abu Dhabi, its new industrial 3D printer humming. We have our own eco-engineering facility. Vriko Yu, Arki Reef's other co-founder, just moved from Hong Kong and aims to help coral move too. The Persian Gulf's waters can rise to 118 degrees. Higher temperatures can kill. We can assist migration of, to help these corals move in deeper waters. Reef tiles can bridge isolated coral communities too, cut off because of mass die-offs from climate change. They can form a much stronger community. It really helps the ecosystem recovery. Arky Reef is hoping to help, one tile at a time. We're asking, if you build it, will they come? The early answer is yes. For CBS Mornings, Ramey Innocencio, Hong Kong. That is some fascinating developments. I, I was just, I'm mostly impressed that Ramey got to go swimming. Swimming. That one. But Have you had reefs? to go swimming for a piece yet? No, not yet, yeah. but I'm hoping for one of those. Uh, the, the reefs are so important to our ecosystem, and what's been remarkable in some instances is oftentimes when water temperature rises and reefs die off, when water temperatures get back to normal, they grow back. So there is some hope that they will continue to do that. Yeah. Well, thank you, Ramey, for that. Now